Hello Space Fans, so welcome to our exciting adventure through the universe. Today, we are going to learn about our closest neighbor in space. Guess what? Today we are going to learn about Moon. Are you ready? Let's go. So, well, what is the Moon? The Moon is a big round of ball that orbits around our planet Earth. It is like our very own sidekicks in space. Now, let's have some fun with a few interactive questions. Are you ready to answer it? If your answer is yes, great. Let's go. Question number one. Is the moon bigger or smaller than Earth? Think about it. Well, if your answer is smaller than Earth, you are correct, my friend. The moon is actually smaller than Earth. In fact, it is about one fourth the size of our planet. Here is another question for you guys. Are you guys ready? I hope you are. Does the moon have its own light? Or does it reflect light from another source? Think carefully. Great job. If you think the moon doesn't have its own light. It actually reflects lights from the sun and that is why it looks so bright and beautiful in the night sky. Have you guys ever think about it? How long does it take for the moon to go around earth? What do you think? When I was a kid, it really fascinated me. How long does it take? So I got my answer when I asked my dad. He told me it takes about 27 days for the moon to complete one full orbit around the earth. That's a pretty long time. But you know our earth is massive. Well, now let me tell you guys a small story. Few months ago, I was playing my PlayStation. Suddenly, one of my niece asked me, Can you breathe on moon? Have you ever thought about it? Well, the answer is no. We can't breathe on moon because there is no air or atmosphere like we, we do have on earth. So if you ever visit the moon, make sure to bring your space helmet. Well done space explorers. You have learned so much about our fascinating moon today. Remember, there is still so much to explore and discover in the vast universe. Keep asking questions and never stop being curious. Until next time, keep reaching for the stars. Thank you so much.